Hello YouTube, Panzer Gaming here, and today I'm playing some Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Uh, this video was done on request of a user on YouTube named Grassnot, and uh, we're doing the Sequence 8 mission Requiem, and we're getting 100%. So, let's go ahead and get started. First thing you want to do is put your crossbow on your D-pad. I have replayed this mission a large amount of times trying to get 100% because it can be quite tricky. Anyway, so we're going to shoot that guy, and... Uh, Apologies, I have to loot him to get more arrows because I am pretty low. So now we climb up this ladder here. And watch out. And we're going to assassinate this guy. Now you'll see in the distance the red dot in Eagle Vision. That's another enemy. So we're going to pull a crossbow. And take a clean shot. So now we're going to loot him, and we're going to climb up here. Okay, just step into the checkpoint. Now there'll be a quick cutscene. I want to see the Pope! His holiness waits for you at the top of the This mission gets pretty difficult on the towards the way. inside uh, part of it where you're uh, inside the castello. So um, this this part if you're having difficulties getting 100% in this part which you shouldn't because if you're good at this game, you know, it, it's you, you can make it throughout here as long as you're watching this walkthrough, but on the inside it's pretty tough. So anyway, there should be a guard on the roof here. We're going to take him out before he notices us. And around the corner, there should be another guard, so don't just run out there. And we're going to assassinate him to save arrows. Okay, so he's done. And we're going to loot him. And now we're going to turn around here, and there'll be two groups of guards, but we're only going to worry about the first one. Well, I guess it's not really a group, but, you know. So we're going to take him out, and uh, then we're going to climb over here and drop down. Be, it should, it's important that you don't use your brotherhood throughout this mission until now, because you'll never know when guards will come around the corner. It varies between uh, how long it takes you to get here to this point. So I'm going to call my assassins on this guy, he's going to get owned, and then we're going to drop down here and swing. And then pull out your crossbow because there's a guard on the roof there who will spot you. So we're going to get him and he's gone. And then there'll be another guard walking up the stairs or around there. So we're going to call our assassins on him and take care of him. Okay, so we are inside now. Okay, my apologies, I had to cut this video into two parts because it's pretty... I screwed up here a lot, I so it's pretty difficult. I ordered a fresh batch of La Cantarella last night. I am terribly sorry, Mia Signora. But the Pope okay, to climb up here, we're going to first go onto Mr. that Cesare. boxes, go into these ledges, he did not keep climbing. Had returned. This part's a little confusing. That woman gives me so much then we're going to grab Why onto the swing pole stable? and swing onto what the bar, the and then up and you're shimmying on the ledge and then you're going to uh... I'm sorry I, I missed it in the playthrough here but I, we're gonna drop down here and then we're gonna swing and then uh... run on the pole and then grab another bar now you're gonna drop forward and then keep climbing to the right and then climb up these grates and go right And you're pretty much there. In this part of the castle, it's really important to uh, watch the red dots on your map. Because these guards are really uh, picky right here of, you know, how how quickly they'll, um, like, spot you. 
So normally there's a guard who patrols from here to the right, from where this like opening is to up the stairs to the right. But we're gonna go on the left and bring out your crossbow because there'll be another guard right just around this corner, I think. Yeah, right there. So we're gonna get him. Okay, and now we're going to go up these stairs, but be careful because there's two guys who go in shifts. Um, see, you can see in the red there, there's one guy, and then there'll be a brute on the left. So we're actually not going to kill them because, um, you know, I don't, I don't want to attract any attention. So no one's, no one's there. You can, oh, never mind, the brute's there. So we're going to get him. And uh, sorry, I missed there. I'm a bit stressed because I've done this a lot. Now this is the hardest room. This is the one that will give you the most, uh, lots of synchronization. Sorry, I, I missed the knife there, but. Now what you want to do is after the first guy is dead, you see there's the guy up on the balcony there. He is really hard to kill because if you shoot him, your arrows will just miss and they'll bounce off the balcony. So what you want to do is sort of take cover behind the wall, out of sight, and I, I try to do it. It's pretty hard. There's no, I'm not sure how they wanted you to do this, but what you do is you target him, and then you sort of move back so that the line of fire moves up a bit, and then you'll actually get him. So I think right, oh, not quite. Hold on. Hold on. Right, uh, right here, I think, is where I get him. I think I go, and then I just pull back. Oh, not quite. It, it, it's really hard. I'm not sure how the game in, is trying to get you to do it, but because uh, I'm getting 100% and, and this is this is the hardest room. There, I think I just got him. Yeah, okay, so he falls down. Now don't run up there yet because his friend will notice and uh, so just let him, you know, go, oh my god, what happened, right? So just let him, let him uh, investigate and then he'll go back to his post. But not before running on the railing because you know people do that normally when they're suspicious that's the funny thing about assassin's creed how do the guards do everything you can do anyway so climb up this bookcase as soon as he's gone back he uh he's pretty stupid so he won't notice you and uh we're gonna have some fun with him and i uh i just found out you could do this the other day you put on your fists and uh Go up behind him, just press X, it'll do an instant kill. Snap his neck. Oh, yuck. Anyway, now don't attract attention to the guards across the roof. You don't really have to kill them, but uh, don't aggravate them because you'll lose synchronization. So just run, climb up here, sorry, climb up here and um, get on top of the roof and then just hit the beacon and you're basically done the mission. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. I hope this helped you guys get 100%. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Okay, bye.